To track your cycle, there are a lot of handy apps out there, but honestly, just using a regular wall calendar or the calendar on your smartphone works perfectly fine. On the first day of your period, circle the date. On the last day of your period, put an X on the date. You're gonna wanna track this for about four months just so that you get an idea of, are my periods regular or are they irregular? From there, you can make some estimates as to where you are in your cycle. The day of your first bleed marks day one of your follicular phase. Most women menstruate for between three and seven days. The follicular phase is roughly 12 to 14 days total, including menstruation. After that, ovulation occurs, which is usually about three to four days. The end of ovulation signals the start of the luteal phase, which goes until the day before your period starts. This phase is usually about 10 to 14 days. It's really important to track your period. It's considered the fifth vital sign. There are the more obvious reasons, like tracking fertility if you want to get pregnant or not get pregnant, but it's also really important to get an idea of the duration of your bleed and whether or not your cycle is regular to get a picture of overall health. Your period should last between three and seven days. Imbalances in our cycle could indicate a broader issue and that our hormones need more support oftentimes through a shift in diet, exercise, and improvement in self-care. Is that fine? Or yeah, not? yeah. Okay. I'm just laughing because you keep doing this. Oh God, <laughs> stop. Well, I'll put an image over 10 it, so, to 14. So you won't be able to see it. Is it circling us? <laughs> I think it's just a different one. No, it's not. It is the same one. It's just circling. Get a life. Imbalances in our cycle could indicate that we need something else in our lives. <laughs> you can feel when you're about to like Yeah, it's up. done. It's just over.